Yeah, let, let me start by asking the, the last piece first. So we have three targets, one for reduction of greenhouse gases and two for increasing access to medicine in low and middle income countries. So in, in all three targets, if we fail to reach any one of these targets, then there's a penalty. And the penalty are for all the four, we had four tranches of bonds, two dollar bonds of five and a seven year and two euro bonds of five and eight year. All these four tranches have the same, you could say, principle that we measure after five years, then the short bonds that are five years, they have a sort of bullet penalty. So for each goal that's missed, we have to pay money to the investors. The eight and seven year bonds, they have a penalty that you pay uh, each time you pay the interest, you pay extra interest, you could say, for the last two or three years. So there's a very clear financial penalty if we do not meet the targets. Mm. So then you can say, how are we going to make sure we meet the targets? Well, when you set out these targets, you have to set them out just as if they were financial targets. So you have to make sure it's audited. You have to make sure that they are sort of certified already by independent organizations. So ISS, ESG have certified our targets. And we've also had the uh, Access to Affordable Medicine uh, Foundation look at it and certified. So you, you are sort of doing it the same way as if it was financial accounting. It's just that there's no real firm standard yet, but you use the best possible certification. And then of course, each year you report on it. You have your auditors look at your reporting. So it's really very much like financial reporting, you could say. I'm it, really interesting to hear how the structure works. So thank you for the explanation. Um, you know, some investors, I, I think even knowing how the terms look, they're still skeptical that without these hard standards that th this is actually, um, you know, it, it is going to do what it says on the tin. What would you say to critics who are skeptical about sustainability linked bonds at this stage? I would say, would it be better if we didn't do it? Because I think we're doing the best we can and we are setting out to help access to medicine in low and middle income countries. We are setting out a firm target to reduce our greenhouse gas emissions. And if people don't like it, it's up to them, but there's no other standard. It's not like there's a EU or UN standard. We're, we're following the WHO's list of essential medicine. So I think we're doing the best we can. I'm not saying it's perfect. I'm not saying there won't be even better standards implemented in maybe five, 10 years. But for now, I think this is the best we can do. And I think uh, you can really not critique us for trying to help the environment and trying to help access to healthcare in, in lower and middle income countries.